everybody, what is going on? It's Kujo Fools, and we are back on Seven Days to Die in our stream. And so in our last stream, I want to say we, you know, started over completely and everything like that. So I've been doing some work off camera um, just to make sure I got a little bit more established. And uh, I died. So, <laughs> I mean, I've got I've got a pretty decent establishment going on here. I've started a new house. Uh on top of the police department and got all of this loot here um, found two treasure chests and then on top of that we also um, we also did some other things like we've already cleared out a specific area and now we're gonna go clear out another one so I found a high school not too far away and I wanna go check that out today um, uh, let's see if I can find it on the map so it is right over here. So I cleared out the stadium, but I decided I would save up on the high school. Um, we went and got a whole bunch of water and things like that off camera and everything. So uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to go and uh, not only collect resources, but um, loot this high school. And I'm lost in here. I'm, oh, there we go. Um, so we're, you know, finally getting getting things done. There we go. We've killed a couple of zombies so far, um, but I know it's probably going to be a little more intense here as the days go on, just because, you know, it does get harder as days progress in this game. So, um, mm. bird's nest. Got excited there. Okay. So we're just going to chop up some wood real quick, and then we're going to go ahead and go out on our little adventure. Um, so it is day five. Uh, we've got one more full day before uh, before uh, the first horde. Um, I'm not too concerned about it, really. Uh, I think we'll be able to manage pretty decently. Um, I think the biggest problem we'll have is the fact that we are on top of a building and not actually, like... Uh, don't actually have very many defenses up so I guess what I'll do is I'll probably stream the seventh night um but the sixth day I'm probably gonna go out and you know like do a whole bunch of um do a whole bunch of like um you know like collecting resources fortifying uh if you guys noticed my house on top of the building definitely needs some structure uh what is it fortification there we go I'm struggling to find words today. It is a Friday, so happy Friday to everybody, and may the 4th be with you. Um, it's just, it's been a really long day for me. Uh, work wasn't too bad, but, you know, it was one of those days where it was like, it was a lot of the things that happened were unnecessary and could have been probably handled better if there had been better preparation, I guess. Uh, my job's normally not too stressful, really, especially since I've switched departments since last year, and... I think it's because I have a really awesome boss, so I'm just I'm just thankful that I have a boss like that. Um, so I have, we've got some wood, um, we'll need to go get more stone, but I do want to check out this high school first. And I can already see there's a couple of zombies up front. And like I said, we did clear out this area, you can see the, um, the wood frames. I picked or sat down to get over the fence there okay so there's two maybe three out front I'm gonna before I get too crazy there we go take these guys out for some reason the arrows won't register unless you're like already like up close and personal with them which I think is bullcrap. I'm trying to hit him in the head, but it's not working right now. There we go. The head shots are terrible. There we go. Got him down a little bit. Okay. We're gonna get annoyed here. 
Alright, I'm gonna have to grab my club. I have a club in my inventory, but I want to make sure I have enough space to get away from them, so that way I can pop it into my inventory real quickly. Yep, here we go. It's a reinforced club. I did finally start getting some some iron. Yeah, hits aren't registering. I'm like hitting him right in the head, too. The struggle is real with these damn zombies. I hit her arm off. That one's down. That one's down. There we go. Damn. The struggle was real there. Shit. Ooh, some painkillers and some food. I hear another one. Yep, I hear him. He's probably in the parking garage. Okay. So, uh, what we'll do first is we're gonna go ahead and kind of, uh, check out the cars, see if there's anything good in them. I did find a, like, level 2 wrench, so I'm, like, super stoked about that, but I haven't used it too much just for the fact that I don't have anything to repair it with. So, um, but I did use it a little bit. We got some electronic parts, so here, here soon we should be definitely getting... Ooh, a shovel. Uh, we should be definitely getting um, getting some things going. Uh, I think the only thing I needed left for uh, what was it for a forge was I think I could make one if I had more wood or something like that. I can't remember. I was in the process of building it in the middle of the night, so oh, well, we'll start with the wood. I normally don't like going in through the front door, but I'm kind of impatient today. There we go. Just a little bit of lag there. There we go. Nice. Okay. Oh, hello! I don't see anybody in here. That doesn't mean anything, though. Oh. Yep, I hear them. They're coming. They're upstairs. While I'm thinking about it. So I have like thirty some jars of water. And I have a whole bunch of them still sitting in my uh, sitting in my uh pit my fire pit back at home, so I need to definitely put more wood in there because I'm pretty sure I burned through it all. I'm going to go ahead and just uh, club whoever's up here. I hear him walking around. Hello? Hello? Yep, there's one. There's probably one in there, I bet. Two there. Um, yeah. It looks like there's two down here. And there's probably some more in the rooms. Oh, got hit. Damn. Oop. There we go. Finally getting them headshots. I'm like worried they're like behind me because I keep hearing them hissing and stuff like that over here. It's making me super nervous. Some more painkillers. Okay, we're gonna practice on this chick over here. There we go. 
she did. Yep. There we go. Okay. Let's see. Uh, looks like a bathroom in there. So I'm assuming what happened to this location is that this used to be a high school and it got turned into a, uh, a safe space for zombie survivors. Okay, let's check in here real quick. Nothing. Coffee beans. Might as well. You can use those for stamina. Alright, did I check this one? Nope. I don't need poo, I'm good. Some more murky water. Murky water. Okay. So, um, I had finished all the basic quests. I don't need those. Um, I finished all the, like, basic quests of, like, you know, you know, setting up a, making a bed and making some clothes. Damn, look at all these hats in here. And, uh, anyway, um, so once we got all that done, we were supposed to find a trader. Well, I accidentally deleted the quest. <laughs> I was trying to figure out how to mark it on my map, and I ended up deleting it. So I figure what will happen is we'll eventually just kind of be exploring and find one. And I'm not too worried right now about finding one just yet, because we're broke as fuck right now. We've got maybe, like, seven casino tokens. And then the rest of it has just been, like, nothing else. So don't have anything too good right now to sell. Some more painkillers. Ooh, take some nitrate powder. We did start making uh, bullets and stuff too. Ooh, a pistol, hell yeah! And uh, we also did get a drop that had a sniper rifle in it, so I'll show you guys that one. Oh, I don't need that when we get back. Okay. Ooh. This room's like completely empty. Ooh, I see where this fool's at. Come here, fool, so I can beat your ass. Another supply drop, I can hear it. I'm trying to take his legs out so that way... I'm somehow shooting right between his legs. There we go. Now I can hit him. I'm chop through that. Make sure there's nobody else in here. Hello? Nope, we good. Okay. Ooh, a blood bag. Might have to head back soon because we're gonna be running out of space here pretty quickly. I'll just take these empty cans and we'll scrap them and use them. Make them into iron. I think this place has been pretty cleaned out. There's like, I'm getting some decent stuff, like some, uh, some medicine, but that's been about it. Okay, I'm sorry. These shoes are ugly. There we go. Much better. Now I have some nice boots. Um, no, dude, why? Ooh, chicken ration, of course. And I'm going to go ahead and eat that now because... My health is at, like, 56, I think. There we go. And we also, like, did some searching in uh, the stadium. Oof! Hell yeah! Um, we did some searching in the stadium, and we found... What was it? We found a beaker. So we're pretty much set now on everything that we need in the campfire except a grill so we need to definitely either find that I don't know I don't think you can craft that but might as well uh, um, but it was definitely something we needed to kinda look into um, I did read a book about pistols too so um, hopefully here soon we can start like 
learning how to fortify it. I'm going to go ahead and chop these up because they get a whole bunch of iron and plastic parts, if you can see down in the right corner. So I definitely want to do as much as I can to uh, collect materials, especially for fortification. There we go. There's nothing in here we can really, like, chop up. But I will... Oh, that's already metal. So I have two pickaxes, too, which is definitely really nice. This one's like a 200-something, so I'll definitely have to fix it here soon. And then the other one is, I think, is a iron one, too. And, yeah, that's like a level 93. So this door got fortified a crap ton. I'm going to switch from the axe to the pickaxe. I don't see anybody in here. I think we're good. What's in here? Nothing. Oh, I was thinking there'd be... Ooh. Anyone up here? Looks like just some dead people. Steel arrows. There are a couple of bags up here too, so there might be some good stuff up here. And I still have the other side of the of the place to check. We're gonna drop these real quick. And scrap those. So that way we have some space for these. Um, that was a 44 Magnum stock. I have a couple of components for a Magnum, but I need the, I think I need the, ooh, look at that wooden club. I think I need the, uh, the schematic in order to make it. So I have to learn it first, I'm pretty sure, before I start putting the parts together. I got another flashlight. Uh, what can I put in there that I don't need? I'm struggling to figure things out now. I'm gonna put this down here. go and boop gone okay what was I after I already have a f oh there's somebody down below I already have the flashlight and stuff like that so I'm not too worried about the hunting rifle parts stuff too because I think I have some at home all right let's check this corpse yeah, see, they're all magnum parts, and I already have some of that stuff set up. Okay, we're going to climb back down there, and then we're going to check out the other side of this place here, too. I'm hoping there's something good. Where's that spot at? There it is. I'll just de e. Okay, so the other side of the building hasn't even been cleaned out yet, and I don't even think I checked out the, s the first floor. Yeah. Well, I don't think there was anything on the first floor. Okay. Oh, it glitched. This looks like another kitchen. Oh no, this is the library. We might find some good stuff in here. I'm hoping to find some schematics, because the only schematics I have right now, I think I've learned the piss. No. The only schematic I've learned is a leather hood. Hello? Somebody's mad. They're like, you better not be breaking into my library. I hear somebody. I don't know where they're at, though. Hmm. Where's this zombie at? 
There you are. Oh, there's two of them. Missed him. Trying to... Like I did earlier. Missed again. I wish this was like, um, you could pick up your arrows. There we go. I'm like hitting him in the head and it's not registering at all. Butthole. Another jar. Where did I get all this broken glass from? There we go. This looks like a nurse. Oh, that body was glitching out. It scared me. It's like, I'm pretty sure I killed this guy already. Come on. I'm running out of arrows here. Got four left. There we go. Used to be an adventurer like you, but then I took an arrow to the knee. Oh, dude, what is that? Was that the rest of her leg? Gross. She didn't even have anything. That's crap, dude. Alright, so... I want to make sure we have some spaces so we can check these bookshelves. Oh yeah, her body was glinching again. It scared me. Shotgun schematic. Heck yeah. Wait, I think that's just shells, isn't it? Yes, yeah, it's shotgun slugs. So, we're gonna go ahead and learn us some knowledge here. It's in here. More paper. Ooh. More paper in there. Some leather armor. Heck yeah. We've been collecting all the armor out of that, or not the armor, the leather out of all of that, um, that entire police station. So we should be set to have plenty of resources in order to make armor. I already know that one, but I'm sure I can learn some more from it. Let's see if I can. Yeah, there we go. What this be? Another pistol book. Heck yeah. Oh, oops. We're just gonna go ahead and, like, another shotgun slug. Almost have 200 paper. Oh, uh, yeah. getting set up here. A nail gun! And a hunting rifle schematic. And we check that side. So now let's check here. Oh dude, we've already hit our limit of paper. That's okay. Um, what do we need to drop here? Mm, I'll drop that piece of cotton. And we'll switch that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. It's okay. Worked in my way anyway. There we go. So both of these are empty. Let's check over here. More paper. We'll be set on paper. Another nail gun schematic. More paper. Oh, look at all this. We're getting set up with these. Oh, I hear another zombie. We'll have to run back soon. 
Oh, yes! An auger schematic. Dude, this is awesome. This was totally worth it coming in here. Did we check in here? Yeah. Okay. So, I don't know if there's another zombie in there, but I hear some growling. So what we're going to do is we're going to go in here real quick. Scope it out. I don't see anything. Yeah, looks like we're good. Oh. Oh, and while we're at it, we'll learn this. So that way we have two vacant spots. There we go. I hear them walking around. They're probably in that room right next door. I'll watch the door to make sure. What's this? Got us some beer. Oh, purple tank top. Heck yeah. We gotta be a little fashionable in here. Put that grain alcohol in there real quick. Yeah, forget this black sweatshirt. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Alright, um... Damn. I think... Yeah, she's ready to beat my ass. Oh, I didn't... I should have known better. Okay, um... Where's my bow at? Get wrecked. Some more pistol ammo. Anything else in here? Oh, I hear crickets. It's gonna get nighttime soon. We're gonna have to haul ass home. Iron gloves. Oh my goodness. We're getting spoiled today. More murky water. We're gonna be set on water. That is for sure. I haven't been checking the trash. Probably nothing good in it, but... I have found a shotgun in a trash can before in this game, so... Oh, there's nothing in there. Okay, I... Do we need that nitrate? I think we're good on nitrate. We don't need to worry about it too much. And then this is another bathroom. I'm assuming this is a classroom. Just for the iron on those chairs. And then after that, we're gonna have to run home because it's almost nighttime. There's probably more good stuff in here too, but like I said, I do need to get home and prepare. There we go. I'll just take that too. Uh, shotgun shells, some steel ammo, or steel arrows. What can I drop off in here? I'm gonna go ahead and put this paper back. Look at that hat. Don't mind if I do. Then we'll just drop that off here. Oh, I didn't mean to pick it up. Damn it. Struggle be real. And then we'll grab this paper back. Alright, let's... How high up are we? There we go. We'll be alright. We got a splint. There we go. Alrighty. I'm gonna head on home. So, um, I do have, like I said earlier, I do have two treasure maps. The one treasure icon is over there, and then the other I haven't even read yet. And then we do have a supply drop not too far away either. So, um, what we'll probably do is, uh, just kind of fortify. Is that a bag? It is a bag. Pistol grip, black t-shirt, empty can. 
come back for it later. Um, anyway, what was I saying? So what we'll do tonight is we'll probably spend the majority of the night uh, just like fortifying the house and stuff like that. And then tomorrow, which will be day six, we'll probably uh, go out and get those supply drops. And then I'm probably just going to fortify. So I'll probably uh, call it quits for the stream and everything like that just because... I want to spend some time preparing. But I want to make sure we get plenty of wood, too. We've got at least... Um, it turns night on uh, at 22 hours. Or 2200, I guess. I'm terrible with time. So, uh, yeah, we've got a little bit more time to gather some stuff. Um, not worried about food. I've managed to kill like two chickens, so we've got plenty of food, I do believe. And I've been kind of eating off and on. Did I hear a zombie? Oh no, it's that deer over there. Damn it. It keeps running on the cactuses. Or cacti, I guess. Come here, you butthole. I'm not worried about food, but I want... I want to at least hit a deer. Oh, I'm going to hold off on the arrows. Um, I need to go get more stone real quick. <sighs> there we go. I'm not worried about that deer now. So, I've been chipping away at this rock for a good, like, three days since we got here. And <laughs> it, has been, <laughs> it has been super constant. I don't like the fact that there's clusters in every single rock that you have to do damage to in order to break the entire thing, but it's kind of nice because it saves me the hassle of like trying to go find um, find other materials to mine and chop up and stuff like that. Um, another thing, uh, while I was uh, off camera, like, oh damn, while I was off camera like doing some work and stuff like that, I did find, I did find like, uh, I did find like some trees and stuff like that that will drop seeds so we do have some trees growing out front I just need to um, make sure I can find some more seeds so that way I can literally start like a a damn forest around me so I'll be set on on trees and stuff I don't plan on the police station being my permanent home uh, it's more of along the lines of like my basic setup just until I have like a mini bike or something like that and can roll around on that. Okay. Oh shit. It's nighttime. My dumbass wasn't even paying attention. not worried about putting spikes down right now just want to get up top I'm still figuring out this place too I'm like getting lost in here and everything yeah there we go and then that over there here we go okay we're safe now Okay, so I'm going to um, there we go, and then I could make coffee. I think I'm going to do it. I've got plenty of bottled water. 
There we go. So while all that is cooking, we're going to go ahead and uh, repair our axe real quick. We need to put some of this crab away, too. Uh, do I have any paper in there? No. There we go. I'll just dump all this crap in here. Um, I'm going to hold off using the pistol and everything like that because I know it does make noise. Do we have any more leather? Uh, yeah, there it is. Oh, rock, wrong thing. I did find some rockets, by the way, too, if you guys noticed. There we go. Some leather. Wait, I think I have the casino tokens in the other chest. I definitely need to do some organization. Yeah, we got nine casino tokens. We're broke. And... Yeah, the rest of that should be able to fit in here. We got 13 painkillers, heck yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to be able to fit much in there. I thought I could, but I guess not. Um, I'll put this in there. Oh, I need that. And what else? The pistol, the shotgun. And I think we're going to keep everything else except the leather duster. And we'll put the raw iron in there. Okay, so let me check my... Um, so my food and my water definitely need to be replenished real quick. go get that up I'm hesitant to get this meat out right now because of it being nighttime but I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway just so I can eat there we go got my health back up too all right let's go ahead and start fortifying. You know what? While I'm thinking about it, I should probably look into the forge too. Because I did, um, I made a lot of stuff. Clay, that's what I need. So I need to go out and get clay here soon too. So that might be something I do either tomorrow or after the seventh night. I do need to get on top and make a roof, but I ain't worried about that right now because since it'll be our first seventh night, I don't plan on seeing any spider zombies. Um, let's see here. Where is the door? There we go. Yeah, it wasn't my plan to build a house on top of the police station, but, like, actually, like, live inside there, but that's just such a wide area for one single person to manage that I don't think I would be able to do it by myself when it came to the seventh night of, you know, like, ch making sure all the entrances and stuff are blocked off and well protected and stuff. I feel like that would be too much for a single player game. So, um,. Eventually, uh, I'll move to a different place where there's a lot more space, but for now, the top part of the police department, I feel, is probably the best spot for me. There we go. Okay, now we can put the doors in, and then I do need to fortify the, uh, the corners. There we go. We got plenty of time here to. There we go. And this corner right here. There we 
go. Okay, and I don't think there's anything else over here that needs to be fortified. Yeah, I think we're good. So anyway, um, for my first forge, I was thinking of honestly just kind of like putting it right over here. Um, kind of a away from my house, but I don't know for sure. So I guess what we could do is we've got enough wood. Maybe we can like set up a little like station or a little house here for the forge to be in too. I know it'll attract screamers and stuff like that, but I do want to make sure that it is kind of protected in a sense. So let's see if we can, where's the, I'm pretty sure it's in my favorites. There we go. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll, so the forge only takes about a, a one corner, so probably like that. And then maybe some storage in here in the future. I'm not 100% sure though. One more. There we go. I don't want to, I'm claustrophobic, so I don't want to be in a tight space. That's not ideal for me. There we go. And then uh, we'll go ahead and we'll like fortify these and then I'll go and grab more wood tomorrow. Yeah, I'm out of wood now. Okay, let's check on our fire here. Alright, it looks like it made everything. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it off and take that wood back. So that way I can build a little bit more on this little forge room. Um, so I don't know how many squares this is. I didn't count it when I was setting it down. That'll be alright. Um, I also need to make a door while I'm thinking about it. A door, 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 door. I think it's, yeah, right here. There we go. Okay, so we'll make a door for the forge room. And set her right there. There we go. Okay, and what else? Um, I guess we'll go ahead and make some more wood frames. I don't know how many I'll be able to make. Ooh, it got foggy and I can't see shit. That's gonna make me super nervous. There we go. And like I said, this room is only for protecting the forge. I'm not too worried about space in here. Um, just want to make sure there is a little bit of space in here for me to like walk in and breathe at least. So what I plan on doing is putting the forge here in this corner and then maybe putting like some storage on top. So that way I can, you know, store things like the, um, the forged iron and steel and stuff like that that I plan on getting together here. That's good enough, I think. Okay. So it is about three o'clock. I guess I could go downstairs and uh, collect more material. Ah, damn. Must have landed too hard. I kind of hurt. So, I think I've checked in here. Yeah. Let me just get that out of here. So, there are, um, 
there is a safe in one of these rooms. Where's it at? I think it's over here. Wait, where, where am I? Yeah, it's over where I fell. So it's back this way. And, um, the health on this thing is insane. So I guess I could just sit here and chop at it. It's going to take me forever because it only takes it down by 10. I was going to use my 200 level pickaxe, but I'm worried about... I don't know if I can fix it. What does it require? Yeah, it doesn't even say what it requires to be fixed, so I don't want to risk uh, breaking all my pickaxes and then not being able to do other things with them. But I haven't checked out this safe, and then there's a safe in one of the office rooms and the other... I want to say it's on the other side of the building that I'll have to like check out, but I'm not 100% sure if um, there'll be anything good in these either. But this is taking forever. It'd probably be easier if I used my pickaxe, but I don't want to. Like I said, because I don't have what I need to fix it. Um, what else was I going to say? Um, yeah, so tomorrow I'm going to go out, see if I can find some clay, get some more wood. Maybe hunt. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if hunting would be an ideal thing to try right now. Just because I'm already, like, lacking arrows and stuff like that. So I need to go out and get more materials to make arrows, too. But we'll see what happens. Um, as of right now, for the schedule, I have I have streamed um, the past few days this, this week. I've, um, I've streamed on Wednesday and Friday. Uh, next week I plan on doing the tradition of Tuesdays and Thursdays instead. Uh, just last week was crazy. Uh, we had just gotten back last weekend from a funeral, and everything was kind of a mess. So Mondays right now I have the entire day off, and that's when I'll be like recording my Ark Survival Evolved series that I post on YouTube, and um, it's also when I do like my random miscellaneous videos too. Um, I need to... I have some Overwatch stuff in the chamber that I need to pop out for everyone... I feel bad because I've been kind of slacking on it, but I do have art to record too, so I'll probably spend Monday all day just recording all the content for the rest of the week, and then on Tuesdays and Thursdays I'll stream and upload those to YouTube. Um, I haven't uploaded the first stream yet um, from the other day, and um, so I think I'm going to do that tomorrow at some point in time. Uh, might even do it tonight. I did up or I did... Yeah, I did upload a video yesterday, so I'm trying to keep it consistent. Uh, but we'll see what happens. As of right now, I'm trying to kind of space everything out and figure things out. Um, I've been trying to upload videos onto YouTube twice a week uh, since I've gotten everything under control with the with my schedule and stuff. And it's just... Uh, Oh, I don't want to, I don't want the moly bread. Put it back. There we go. Uh, I just, um, wanted to kind of, like, figure some things out beforehand. Uh, before I started, you know, making up a schedule. So, yeah. So, for streaming, it's not always going to be Seven Days to Die. Um, maybe some Overwatch, maybe some older games, too. I wanted to start streaming with, uh, Jade of Empire, or Empire, Jade Empire. I don't know why I was thinking that. I wanted to do that, but the screen is super small just because it's an older game and it's not going to be the the greatest when it comes to quality, but it kind of gave me that like nostalgic feel to it because I played it when I was way younger and I love that game. So I might stream some of that next week. I'm not 100% sure yet. Um, if you do want to see that, just let me know. Um, but as of right now, my main thing that I'm going to stream is probably going to be this game and maybe Overwatch. We'll see. Um, I'm still kind of debating that because I haven't been playing Overwatch the past few weeks. And it's just because, you know, it's dying pretty much. Which, uh, it is what it is. Um, so we're down to like 400 health here, finally. 
I went through this pickaxe or this axe like four different times already. I'll probably go through it at least two more times before we open this. We've been wasting the entire time working on that. That it's almost daytime. We're just going to go out on daytime. I don't care. We'll come back for that thing later. So we'll go to the strop first. And then after that, we'll go and um, get the materials we need. Like I said, I'm like lost here. I, I struggle to get out of this building. Just because there's so many doors and stuff. I think my character is thirsty. There we go. Drink some water there. Our stamina pop back up. We good. Oh look! The trees are growing already. We're gonna let them grow a little bit longer before we try chopping them down. And there were some trees over here, I do believe. Yeah. I don't like the fact that it's foggy and it's the sixth day. Oh, I said I was gonna get the supply drop first. I'm sorry. I'm so out of it right now. We'll chop this tree down and then go get that. Okay, so the supply drop is over that way. Um, let's check the map real quick. Yeah, it's a bit of a distance. But it might be worth it. So we're going to go ahead and see what's in it once we get there. Like, trying super hard not to hit these damn cactus. That's what got me killed the last time, was not only avoiding zombies, but I, like, hit two or three cactus. Oh. That's not good on you either. Don't run downhill. A little lag. This supply drop's probably been sitting out here forever. Oh, there's a zombie. Can't see in the fog. Oh. I was like, whoa, what is that? It's just a house. I'm kind of scared. Um, I've noticed... Ooh. Oh, I thought that was a person. I've noticed that there's a lot of bears out here for some reason. Oh, there it is. I don't know what I was running to. It is so foggy out. This is ridiculous. Ow, damn it, I stepped on one. There we go. Ooh! SMG! Yep, it was worth it. Alright, we're gonna head back now. I don't know where we're at. It's too foggy out for me right now. I can't cope. Got to get out of here. Oh, I need to pick up some more cotton, too, for bandages. Oh, here's zombie. Sounds like a bunch of them, too. Pick up some more gold rod, too. We can get up this hill. This is the hill I think I died on, too. I was trying to go uphill, and I fell down and hit a cactus, and then there's a fat zombie at the bottom just ready to destroy my ass. Definitely sucks. I don't like these hills. You would think I would be smart enough to use the roads, but I feel safer doing this than using the roads right now, because I can't see anything. 
I thought that was a nest. Oh goody, more paper, because that's what I need right now. Oh, it's raining. There we go. Okay. Back home safe. Yay. So, um, yeah, what I'm going to do today is probably just, um, make sure I got plenty of materials to last me, um, during horde night, because I plan on putting a whole bunch of spikes out by, like, in front of the door and stuff like that, and kind of barricading myself on top of that police department, and hopefully that'll work out for us. So, um, I'll probably be back next week to stream this, um, and I'll start with the Horde Night. So, anyway, you guys, that's going to be it for this stream. Um, I'm gonna, just going to sit here and collect and do that kind of fun stuff, and I'll be back on the seventh night. So, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye!